YouTube was good. It's your boy Jody Joe. Welcome to Jody's Corner. I got my Ren Goku sword, but that's neither here nor there. We're talking about Johnny Depp and Amber Heard. <gasps> the update. Let's get to it. We're gonna do an update on the Johnny Her Johnny Depp Amber Heard case, and there's a couple of clips that I want to show you guys, and we're gonna do a brief update and have a discussion. First things first. I'm Jody Joe. New guy, Kai the guy, Super Jim Bean is here. <laughs> I don't accept that, actually. <laughs> I'm going to call him Kai the guy. That works. Like, He'll he accept it. Rhymes. You see Kai the guy is in here. Man, what's up with you, man? I'm chilling. I am, I've seen a little bit of clips, right, especially cool. the stupid shit that the lawyers are coming up with. <laughs> Fargo's here. What's up with you guys, dog? Saddle of War. <laughs> The man, the myth, the legend, of code. Let's get it. Flash. Yeah. E. What's popping? <clears throat> we the Just Us League. Let's take a look at this little clip right here where he's talking about, uh, you know, the court case. Let's see what he has to say. After you burned her and after you drowned her. Did I read that right? <coughs> you certainly did, yes. And you wrote that about the woman who would later become your wife. Yes, I did. Depp also sent his bodyguard this text. On January 17, 2013, you texted, I'll smack the ugly around before I let her <coughs> apologies again to the court and the jury for this language. And then you closed by saying, did that worthless hooker arrive? Did I read that right? You did, sir. And you think that you live up to the standards of a Southern gentleman? Oh. That was essentially, yes, raised to be a Southern gentleman, that is to say, when chivalry was uh, still alive, uh -huh. allowed. These text Whoa. messages are oh, no. <laughs> chivalry is dead. They're also on the big screens throughout the courtroom. The jury is leaning in. Some put on their glasses so they can see and read along with the defense attorney. And there are some really looks of disgust. Depp's friendship with famous pals like wow, Marilyn Manson came wow. up in testimony. One of your good friends that you've taken drugs with before is Marilyn Manson, right? <laughs> yes, we uh, 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 We drank together. Uh, <laughs> we, we've, uh, we, we've, 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 we Damn! Yeah, tried to crack a joke about it. You would sometimes drink whiskey in the mornings too, right? Um, I, 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 I you know, I mean, isn't happy hour any time? <laughs> that's cocaine. That's, that's, white wine. That's, that's, right. coca that's cocaine, right? I would assume. Yeah, exactly. and that's that's your cocaine that you kept in that box that says "Property of JD" with the skull and crossbones, isn't it? The box was a gift from someone. I can't say that I carried cocaine in it now. <laughs> You but can't it, say that you carried cocaine in that box? No, but it looks like it would fit some cocaine. <laughs> You've trashed hotel rooms before simply because you've had a bad couple days and an unpleasant time, correct? I have assaulted a couch or two. Yes, sir. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, boy, I'm playing. Johnny Depp going Johnny back and forth. Shy, bro. Johnny Depp is really playing with that freaking defense attorney, man. Like... A, a lot of it has to do with the fact that he had to talk about uncomfortable things, dark things in his past that the attorney was bringing up in order to show that didn't really serve a purpose outside of trying to make Johnny Depp look like a bad person. Mm -hmm. right. How could you, someone who's addicted to drugs and pills and who's addicted to alcohol doesn't make them a bad person, doesn't make them a, 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 an abuser. That's not how it works. But the defense, what I've learned from this, from watching hours of this trial is that the defense is relying on ignorance of the public and the ignorance of the jury to try to convince them of something that is clearly not the case. It's not the case, but at the same time, a lot of these elements, such as cocaine, can lead to the abuse that has been happening in a relationship. That's the whole thing. That's, that's the biggest who, thing. Wh who, where, what statistic is out there that says, because you do coke, you're going to beat your wife? No, no, I'm just saying, it, that's what usually leads to it, though. Like, you, you, would, you, would, you would assume... Usually. You would... You would no, 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 he will fall for it. No, 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 I'm not saying I will fall true. for it. I'm just saying, but it, it's cases to where a person who's drinking alcohol is abuser. Who who's abused? I think it's a it's a person who's an abuser who drinks alcohol and drugs would be more of an abuser. Mm, okay. I don't think a sober, non-abusive right. person would get high on coke and then all of a sudden become an abuser. Right. Is it possible? Sure. Is it likely? Heck no. But if you're not an abusive person, 
I don't think that you're going to be abusive under any circumstances. Now, if you're, <laughs> if, if you have that inner, like, like there's people that have two personalities, like they, not so much two personalities, but they have a side where they're really truly inside living depression and a dark, angry life. But on the, on the surface, they hide it. Will. Sometimes alcohol will bring that out of you. <laughs> I'm yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But that just magnifies who you truly are. Right. I don't think that it's yeah, bro. Like Sad said, you would have been one of the jury members. No, like, yeah, stop, you're right, stop. You're stop. I'm just trying to look. I'm just trying to look at another side of it. That's all. Oh, it you're is. trying I'm, to look I'm at. I'm not. I'm not saying that I'll agree. No, I'm. Oh, t- do not speak for no. You fucking face, nigga. Do not speak for me, nigga. I am Team Johnny, nigga. That bitch deserve to get what she gonna get, and I hope she. I hope she loses. But I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just, I'm just trying to twist it up. It's just okay. It up. All right, no, no, I like that. I like that that he did that. Hey, Kai the guy. Mm-hmm. Uh, how do you feel about the the clip that you just watched about him with the drugs and all that, the alcohol and stuff? When this is a case about defamation, they're reaching. You're right. They're reaching their asses yeah. off. Yeah. They one they they picked they he picked one of his old colleagues, which is Marilyn Marilyn Manson, who already does. Who's known for doing some shit? And they pick Maryland. Maryland of all Manson. people, exactly. If they 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 take an old ad, they take an old other shit. I looking at that picture and Bro, looking at how the, old was that? The nineties? Yeah, it was most definitely the nineties or some yeah, shit, bro. Like look, he looked like he just did Edward Scissorhands. I was like, fucking. Yeah, there it is. That is an old Come picture, on, dude. How old is this picture? Yeah, that's young. Look at how skinny his face. That's skinny. Yeah. Jo- that's like. Sweetie Todd, Johnny? Even before then, probably. That's before ever, though. Yeah, way before ever. Way, way before, before ever. ever. They, they, they took, they took, they're trying, they're going from who he associate or associates or as used to associate with and then taking old stuff. Yeah. Like when you said uh, you're doing this shit for the public, obviously the public's not going to know that Johnny Depp did all this addiction shit because it's fucking Johnny Depp. Yeah. Um, even if, even with, even that, most people who see, who see like a superstar and shit, Everyone kind of knows that they did some shit, but I wouldn't use that against him. It's old. By this time, given how old he is, he's probably fucking kicked it already. Do you think it's possible that somebody who is associating with these people, because they talked about Paul Bettany. Paul Bettany is the actor who plays Vision in the MCU. Mm-hmm. Okay. He's, it was talked about how him, how Johnny and Paul Bettany did pills, coke, <laughs> All type of Xanax, all type of shit, drugs together. Mm-hmm. Kind of dragging Paul Bettany into it. Because I didn't know Paul Bettany was on drugs and shit like that. And he's in the MCU. And you know to be in the MCU, you almost got to be squeaky clean. You're messing mm-hmm. with his career So right who there. knows what happens with Paul Bettany now that the world knows that he does freaking all different types of drugs. Yeah. Right. But I thought that when I talked to you the other day, they said that Amber got on the elevator and started seeing somebody. And he was like, was it Paul Bettany? Wasn't she found, like, sleeping around with one of his friends? Johnny Depp believes, and he has some evidence to show that Amber Heard was having an affair with James Franco. Fun. James Franco and Amber Heard did a, a movie together called Pineapple Express. They sure, did. they sure did. They also did another movie together, which is the one they were talking about mostly, um, and having an affair with Elon Musk. Right. And uh, he accused her. It was it was said that she was accused of. Having a threesome with Karen Evangeline and, and Elon Musk. Oh, shit. Amber Heard, Karen Evangeline, and Elon Musk oh, had a damn. threesome in Elon the attic. Elon Musk. I don't, know, <laughs> I, don't know, I, don't know, I don't know who Karen is, but I know who Elon Musk is. Karen Evangeline is the, is, the, is the chick from... Uh, the, Ant-Man. The, she was in Ant-Man. That's not her. That's not her? Ghost? That's not her. Oh, my, no, the, the other one. Ain't that her name? No. You oh, talking no. about the chick from Valkyrie? No, that's not no, her. What's no. that? Space movie? Utopia? No, what Utopia? You What's that space movie? Yeah. I don't know, look at her name. Carrie Evangeline, uh, Carrie? she's in Chantress from uh, from Suicide Squad. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. Thank, thank you. Uh, who said that? Uh, she looks like she's on drugs. Yeah. Oh. She do look like oh. she Valerian. That was the name of the movie. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, I seen right. that trash movie. Yeah, that movie was. Yeah. That movie was trash. trash. That's some wild shit. But uh, well, the question: Does hanging with the Johnny Depp being seen with people like Marilyn Manson, being associated with Marilyn Manson, is not a good look? It makes him look. Was, it makes him look bad though. You know what I'm saying? Does that does that help in this case though? Because that, with this specific, specific Wait, situation, when it, when it comes mm. to her, she's trying to make it that way. She's trying to say basically that Johnny, uh, instead of looking like that, she put her hands on Johnny. Johnny is abusive. He's a drug addict, 
And you know how drug addicts and alcoholics are. You know, I don't know um, what that means. You're literally a person could be paint. nice, you could be nice one time, and the next thing you know, you flip out because you're not in your right mind when you're doing drugs. A lot of people who do drugs don't know what the fuck they're doing. They, they, you know, drugs is just to make them feel better, to make them feel numb. But it also can have different effects of you too. So she's trying to make it look like that. You see how she's all more like this with the suits and shit to make it look like she is the, the, the good you guy. You disagree? No, I don't disagree. But sometimes like these pictures like this. Johnny Depp could be arriving in his own car. Marilyn Lewis could be with three people. And then the photographer say, Johnny, Marilyn, can you guys come? Let me take this picture real quick. And then right. they take these pictures. Not that they weren't friends. I'm just saying that they might not Which even be together. they did say together. that they were friends. They though. are they friends. They might not even be together in this picture. They right. might just be in the same place matter. at the same time. And the worst part is that the same machine that builds you up, now we get entertainment. It's on Inside Edition. Like, we're not watching this on Court TV. We're watching it on the same show. It's mm-hmm. going to tell us about the new Johnny Depp movie. Yeah, so right. they still, the machine is just, they'll just eat it's you going. up and spit, yeah. you, spit you out, it's man. Going. It's crazy. They want to make Johnny look like yeah. the bad guy, bro. They want to, they, they, they constantly do it. It's like not that. even him on trial. It's his personality is yeah. on trial. His whole life is on trial. His lifestyle is on trial. It's more than just him on trial. But seeing this right here, they're already trying to, already making it look like he's the bad guy. You don't have anything with Amber. You might get a tape. Pictures, he didn't. He wasn't. He could have played that the whole way. Just because that's she could have staged that picture. Yeah. How do you? Who just takes a picture of Coke in somebody's house with? Hey, that could Robert, be he and Jody Joe. Here's Jody's. Uh, here's Jody's. Uh, I'm so. Here's Jody's sword, and here's some cocaine, and obviously, like, obviously he did his thing, but ain't no household. <laughs> if I left some some drugs on the table, my wife would flip out. Like, what is this? People to party together, so Amber ain't no innocent yeah, you think, person. You think, do you think that if Johnny is doing coke, she not doing it with him? Or, or, you know, or she party. Mm-hmm. She doing he this thing too. from a party how I you, had the night before. How do you not well, know? I'm not, not going to assume that either. How do we though? not know that the shit that she planted? Because Johnny's not in Obviously, you know that. He's Somebody took truth, that picture, Jody. But he, 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 he's still not in his mind. <laughs> the still, license, the, not the, his license mind. the driver's license was turned upside down. Yeah. Yeah. The license is a weird ass touch. And the thing say property of Johnny Depp. and Oh, the picture of the drug. Yeah, That's Amber. Amber set Johnny building up throughout the entire. She was building a case on Johnny for That's years. That's what I'm saying. Bro, there's a video. Oh, there's shit. an audio. There's audio of Johnny in a, in, a, in a hotel room somewhere about to cut himself. And she's like, don't cut yourself. Don't do it. Don't. He's recording. She's recording <laughs> private conversations oh, to make him look bad. They're playing that shit in the court. And it's making it look like this guy's completely on edge, which he might be as far as his own. But that ain't got nothing to do with abuse on you. Right. There's and also some other knowledge. stuff. There's, we would have never found out none of this stuff if she hadn't. Here's him talking about the incident that happened to his finger. Check this out. There, she went there. And so I was leaning like this in the chair, looking at her. First bottle went, then got the other bottle shot. Takes the second bottle, which is the larger one. I'm in this position again, and my my hand is on the edge of the the bar, like like that, and leaning over the fingers, like that. And uh, she threw the large bottle, and it made contact and shattered uh, everywhere. And I honestly didn't, I didn't feel the pain at first at all. I felt no pain whatsoever. What I felt was, um, I felt heat. I felt heat and I felt um, as if something were dripping down my hand, you know. Um, And then I looked down and realized that the, the, the tip of my finger had been severed and uh, I was looking directly at my bones sticking out and uh, the, the, the meaty portion of your, the inside of your finger um, and it was, it, blood was just uh, pouring out. And at that point, I, 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 
I think that I went into some sort of... She's puffy as shit. I don't know what a nervous breakdown feels like. But that's probably the closest that I've ever been. I didn't... Nothing made sense. And I knew in my mind and in my heart... This is the biggest part. This is... This is not life. This is not life. I knew right then this is not life. Like, where I, look at where I'm at. I'm Johnny Depp, and I got a freaking severed Depp. finger here. What the freak? People's perception of me is I'm having fun. I'm in Hollywood. I'm living let Look at me. This is the reality of it. Fuck. I don't never need to see any of my bones. Yeah, that's the, Yeah, she yeah. threw a bottle in it, just shattered, shattered its finger. Uh, so, Flash, what do you think about that, man? Man. I don't know why she's throwing stuff at them if they are in an argument. It, just settle down like adults and talk it out. Oh, she got mad, though. Uh, everybody gets mad in arguments. I mean, a woman can't physically fight a man. Then why throw stuff? She can throw some shit. Just, just don't throw stuff. Then why throw it? Because if he would have just <laughs> got up it, it. if he would have just got up and did the same thing to her, then what? Jail. <laughs> right. But, but women are consistently testing our masculinity. All the oh, time, shit. every day. No. Women consistently hit on men. Hit, 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 punch, sock in the chest, tell you to man up and punch you. <laughs> like the recordings, I didn't punch you, I didn't deck you, I hit you. So, oh, you're such a baby. Yeah. Recordings of her saying, you're such a baby because I hit you, I didn't punch you. Man up. This is the type of society that we live in. This society is really bad, and they, it's, it's just, this whole relationship that they have, it's, it's horrible. Really no, horrible. What's your take? That's true. That's true. Well, as far as the first part with the, with the drugs, I have to agree. They're attacking his- Hey, man, try man. Fuck. What are you talking about? I don't say nothing. They're attacking his character, which is true. I agree with you. His character has nothing to do with- uh, him uh, uh, physically assaulting her because if that was the case, then we'd have evidence of him doing this to previous relationships that he's been in, right? But this is not the case, so I don't even know why they would do that. And to to to, to as Virgo was putting it, I don't know about this. Usually the case that people who do drugs or drink usually are abusers. I don't know if it's like that. I know usually, sure, an abuser might seek drugs and alcohol to numb whatever mental pain they're going is, through if you do drugs and you do alcohol does that make your case look better or worse i mean it it makes it look worse to the the, the ridiculous public sure but so i understand why they're bringing this yeah shit up. but on the surface uh i'm, I'm agreeing with my man over there kind the guy yeah they're 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 fishing they're fishing hard because if you go back to the recordings and what johnny what the words that are coming out of their mouth it sounds like she's the aggressor and he's not. Mm -hmm. Like, he's the one who doesn't want things to escalate to violence, and she's the one that wants to take it there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So that's all they have to do. They have to fish. Yeah, exactly. Because there's, there's a bigger payout in her, in her benefit. She's going <laughs> to she's gonna gain more. She's countersuing for $100 million. Mm -hmm. He's suing her for $50 million, She's countersuing for 100 Exactly. She's, he's making more money, obviously. Yeah. And, and they're, they're using this. They do this to rappers all the goddamn time. They use their lyrics now in court. To hold, you know, hold them accountable, oh which is ridiculous, and, and and this is exactly what they're doing to this man, and which I'm fucking. Hating, Does anybody bro. know if this case is, you know, since he's the husband, that's the wife, he's paying for her lawyers and all that shit. Is that what's going on here? No, she's paying for she her, paying her own own lawyers. She's paying for her lawyers. Because they're already divorced, right? Yeah. Oh, okay, never mind. Never mind. Yeah, um, that Aquaman money can help pay for lawyers. Was she awarded? When you said that. Um, no, that, that Aquaman, that Aquaman money can pay for the lawyers, right? <laughs> You know, she ain't getting that big of a She's full of already. shit, though. I mean, this obviously shows that even on the recordings, she's abusive, bro. She's, she's to use to... When women like that who get angry and upset and can't have their ways, automatically they will do whatever it takes to, to push your button. If it comes to throwing shit, calling you names verbally, no matter what it is, they will do it. Because they want you to, to act. Especially someone that's rich or famous as she is. Johnny Depp is the breadwinner. He's the one that everybody wants, everybody loves. They people don't really give a like Amber Amber Heard like that. So 
she want to make it look like that she is the person who's been good and because of the drugs Johnny under under like undercover has been doing bad shit to her which we clearly know that's not the case she she known for for doing shit like that he said she's abusive when you grow up and have an abusive situations and no matter like oh baby this is, she has mental issues it's already clearly to see it right here. She has mental All right, problems. let's go ahead and check this video right here. This is a video of the inside of the house that people were talking about. Happen. You. I don't think so. Out of control. Over the edge. The harrowing and disturbing video of Johnny's rampage played for the entire world to see. You want to see crazy? The argument exploded in the kitchen of Johnny's West Hollywood, California home. Johnny pouring himself a giant glass of red wine in the middle of a verbal battle that Amber was not so secretly recording. Have you drunk this whole thing this morning? Oh, he got this. You got this going. Oh, really? Really? And that's you in the video, Mr. Depp, right? That's correct. And you would agree that you were violent in that clip, correct? Um, clearly I was having a bad time. Johnny faced off with Amber's attorney on cross-examination. May have been drunk in that video, correct? There's a possibility of that. This... And the embattled actor laid out his own defense. I, I did not uh, try to intimidate Ms. Hurd. If she was intimidated, why was she filming? If she was scared to death, why didn't she leave? But Amber was brought to tears after hearing the next dramatic piece of evidence. Don't, don't cut yourself. Please don't cut yourself. Cut. Please don't cut yourself. Please, I know what you're doing. I would never cut you. The shocking audio of Amber begging Johnny not to harm himself was recorded in 2016, two months after they filed for divorce. Put the knife down. You're going to hurt yourself. Please stop. Well, look at you. I know you're in pain. Wait. Stop. Please don't. wait for the pain to go. It's not that. It doesn't oh. make you go. Trust me. There's love here. There's love here. It was recorded a year and a half after the incident in Australia, where Johnny claimed Amber threw a vodka bottle at him, severing his finger. Her lawyer countered. You actually told the hospital uh, that you had cut it off with a kitchen knife. Isn't that right? No, that's not true. Okay, so we see oh, the wow. bashing of the cabinets. Johnny looks violent. He's doing, you know, the cabinets. He's having a, an episode, a clear episode, right? Mm -hmm. Right. You know, he's drunk. He's upset. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Finds the recording, takes the phone, throws it. Uh, does this help Amber's case? Uh, Kai the guy, does this help her case? In a way, yeah, because again, with the with the way they're going by being reaching, they're trying to paint the picture of him being a violent person, especially when he's drunk. Um, when I was looking at it, I was like... Um, I see that someone who, as you said, he had a bad day. Sadly, he was drinking. That that made it worse. Right. But fucking, um, I can, as we all know, when men when men are angry, they tend to, it's a whole it's a whole shit show. I was I was mainly trying to think of the he he didn't do anything to he didn't hurt her. He was just going. He was just angry. Does Johnny look bad in the situation? He yeah, they, because they're making it look like that. Uh, he's the one that cut his own finger. In this, you know, grabbing a bottle, you know, saying I'm gonna cut myself. Then next thing you know, this shit right here, and make it look like he is like I said. Oh, the cut myself was not about the finger. The cut myself was about just. But I'm just saying, like, like you know, like, to himself. like, it was, not like we saw, we saw the bottles and the, the shit like that that he was doing. Them, so it make it look like that he was the one that that did this shit. Yeah, with the cutting, with with him apparently you know I mean? cutting himself. And yeah, then, yeah, yeah, yeah. Does it make him look bad, Flash? It it does make him look bad. Um. You know, being drunk and they having the time early in the morning, they said, uh, slamming cabinets. I mean, he's, even though it's, it makes him look bad, he still didn't do no physical harm exactly. to the woman. Mm -hmm. exactly. He, uh, I mean, she probably did feel frightened. She probably thought that he might, but he, we saw on video, See, he chat. didn't do anything. We saw on video that I he didn't do chat, anything. Bro. Hey, we gotta have a, we're having a discussion, bro. <laughs> you just glued to that chat. I looked five times and I caught you. I said, the sixth time I catch him, I'm saying something. Your <laughs> goddamn eyes out that chat, E. I thought you don't be looking at the chat, big dog. 
I'm looking. You've been living in that bitch. He is talking. I'm looking at the You've screen. You've been living in that motherfucker, bro. He is. I'm calling your shit out. All right, fool. <laughs> God dang, bro. <laughs> like you didn't even hear what he said. Let me ask you, E. Oh shit. What did Flash say? Oh shit. He said that it, it does make him look her, uh, him look like the bad guy, and it also too he said about uh, him throwing stuff or whatever. But he didn't. He was never violent towards her whatsoever. The first part you said was right, and everything else to the left. My nigga. Damn. <laughs> Stay out that goddamn chat, E. You looking for negative comments, bro? Yeah, Eric Mika said it went over your head. Yup. Damn. <laughs> it went over your head. Hey. <laughs> Sad. Go ahead, bro. Oh, shit. <laughs> Eric really Mika. Just, um. As a, flash. Man, as a man that has. I had a temper. Broken some shit. I have a temper. Um, seeing him slamming cabinets. See, that's her. He would rather break. He didn't break. It's a glass cabinet. Johnny is clearly capable of breaking a glass front cabinet. He's slamming it. He's mad. He's riled up. He's drunk. But he's taking it out on objects that don't have feelings. <laughs> that's what we that's, do. That's, exactly that's what, what we do. The, he can buy a new cabinet. He can't buy a new person. Right. Amber is 15 feet away. She has time to run, leave, slam the door. When you see violent violent men, they are banging on the door trying to get in. She was in arm's length of him. If she, if he wanted to hurt her with that same vengeance and anger, yeah. he walked over and poured himself a drink in more pain. He didn't he wasn't so drunk that it spilled on the table. He calmly poured himself a big old glass of wine because he wants to pass out and go to sleep and wake up and she's gone. He yeah. wants to wake up three yeah. weeks from now. Yeah. He can't believe his great life has turned into this. Now, I say this to y'all, women and men that's in bad relationships. I've been in horrible relationships, okay? It's hard to get out and you feel like there's nothing else, and you want to hurt that person like they hurt you, mm -hmm. and a person that says they want to cut themselves it's because they know they can't cut you, but they can cut themselves to hurt themselves to hurt you. So I still don't see, I see him out of control. I see this being a bad, dysfunctional relationship, but I still do not see him as a beater. You know what I mean? I don't see him what? as an abuser what? yet because these aren't the characteristics of one. Mm -hmm. She is on. If you really want to hurt her, she's right there. Yep. And when he saw the phone, he couldn't take that no more. Like, oh, really? I'm performing for you now? Yep. I wouldn't even want my wife recording if we're having an argument. If I get in an argument sometimes because, um, and we're in a building, my wife would say, hey, the neighbors can hear you. You're like, I don't care if the neighbors hear you. She cares because she doesn't want other people to be in our business. Mm -hmm. And so imagine me trying to film an argument. Try to film an argument with your wife or your girlfriend or, or your boyfriend or whatever. Mm -hmm. See if that doesn't set that person off. They're going to snatch the phone and your phone might get broke nine times out of ten. Facts. Any of mm -hmm. us. Even a guy. So these guys and then all this cocaine that come in. Drug bus. 300 tons of cocaine. Uh, uh, kilos. 150 kilos. Somebody's doing these drugs. I've never even seen real drugs since 1993 like or something. I don't, I've never seen lots of drugs, but somebody's doing it, and everybody in the courtroom act like they ain't doing it. These high price lawyers is doing it too, because I can't afford it, and it's not my lifestyle. But a lot of Hollywood people, all over, it's not just Hollywood, it's Miami, it's New York, it's all over the U.S. So these drugs, you're trying to paint a, they painting a picture. That's the lawyer's job, and there's a reason they got a male lawyer. Uh, versus a female lawyer. They try they stacking the cards against him and I hope he comes through it. But the whole relationship is bad, bad, bad. As the girl said in um what's the movie with Woody Harrelson and the girl? Uh, bad, 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 bad. No. What's going on here is that Saddle Wars people spitting facts. Mm -hmm. I agree. We tend to punch holes through walls. I've done that. We tend to kick something, throw kick kick a hole in the cabinet or some shit. I've done that. Throw something, break something. That's us letting our frustration out in a physical way. So uh, on inanimate objects so you don't have to put your hands on somebody. 
But then they're in the courtroom and this man appears making it seem like that's violence. Sure, we should be able to eventually, we should be able to control ourselves to where we don't have to punch holes through the wall. And that's why we need counseling. Johnny Depp probably needs to see an anger management yeah, sure. uh, therapist or something like that. Natural born killers. Get off the freaking uh, drugs and shit. Yeah, that type of stuff. But as far as abuse and intimidation and all that, you can't use our coping mechanism for not being violent to call us violent. I guarantee it's 40 knives in that kitchen and a hammer and a glass. And he, he went near none of that. Right. It's he, weird, He's bro. slamming plates and, and, and cabinets. Right, I'm like, dang, this nigga rich. When I saw him doing them cabinets, this nigga got good cabinets. <laughs> he was slamming the shit out of those cabinets. He was trying to break that shit off, but he couldn't. Because he's rich, he got good cabinets. <laughs> but that have been my cabinets. My shit would have flew right off the goddamn end. Screws and all. Right out that press wood. I don't even got real wood cabinets. Why would bro. Bro. <laughs> shit came right the freak out. I don't even think the screws are holding my cabinets. I'm just the paint. <laughs> <laughs> Shots of the paint holding our cabinets together. Thank you guys so very much for watching this. This is always just for Johnny here on Jody's Corner. You best believe that. Shout out to my man Kai the Guy, Virgo King, uh, my man with the Flash hat, Sal Award, spitting fire today. The man of the legend of code, Flash E. We the Just Does League. We out this thing. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And don't be stuck in a bad relationship. Get out, y'all. Like, comment, subscribe, out. you guys. Thump that video, free 99 you all day. Do don't it. forget to Share, show love to the JC family. That's what you think about it. You like, you don't like it. Let's know what you think. Keep it a buck and do it.